Well, new tonight, only 11 at 11 has an update on eight-year-old Kyrie Beecham. Now, she made national headlines after undergoing a quadruple transplant at Children's Hospital. And Channel 11's Carly Flynn Morgan talking to her mom for the first time since that surgery. Kyrie's mom, Nan Beecham, stepped away from her daughter for just minutes this evening to speak with us outside of Children's Hospital. Overall, it's good news. So today, uh, she's doing very well. She's resting comfortably up in her room. Everything looks fantastic with this transplant. Um, there's been no signs of rejection whatsoever. Less than two weeks after the surgery, Kyrie has had some challenges, including a collapsed lung and frustration surrounding her breathing tube. But you can't keep this eight-year-old's spirit down. <laughs> she is a person. You can see her personality coming through every picture that's that's there of her. It's just she ha she's very captivating. That's led to more than 23,000 followers on her Kyrie's Dream Team Facebook page. Her followings about doubled <laughs> in the past week. People from more than 20 countries watching every picture and post. I'm actually just more overwhelmed by all the support that uh, our own community of Elwood has shown her. It's just been tremendous. People who will welcome her back home whenever she's recovered. I just want to see her doing the things that she's been wanting to do, to be able to go swimming without IV lines connected to her, to go to the beach and not worry about if the sand is getting in her medical equipment. For now, this future cheerleader has people across the world rooting for her. Carly Flynn Morgan, Channel 11 News. And Kyrie's new organs were donated by the family of Ariana Morales. She passed away from a condition that kept her brain from developing fully. Now, we know this story has touched just a lot of hearts out there, and we have Kyrie's story posted on our WPXI Facebook page, and you can leave your well wishes for her and the family right there.